So the other day I uploaded an amazing money glitch, how you can earn infinite amounts of money eddies within Cyberpunk Phantom Liberty. Today guys, I bring you the same method, but the most efficient way. There's, there's no better way of doing this guys. It's going to be unreal. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So this is the old soul junk duplication glitch. For people that don't know, we'll explain it from the start. But first of all guys, you need to get yourself some junk. Now there are plenty of junk shops around Night City, but the one I go to is located about there. That's where it is. It's a part of this little setup there. If you go inside there guys, there's a junk shop. And what you want to do guys is you want to purchase a stack of one set of junk, anything over two. So four, five, six, seven, all the way up to 10, perfectly fine. And you want to purchase one of any other piece of junk. So you should be left with what I've got right here. So you can see I've got nine of one and one of the other. That's what you want. That is the perfect setup. Then guys, you want to come to where I am at on the map right here. This is where you want to come to. As you can see, there's n this is unreal guys. You, you wait until you see this. Okay, so when we're here guys, this is the Gold Nawaki Plaza. The best part about this is there's two drop points right next to each other right there, as well as a fast travel point. Now from here guys, you want to pull out a car. Now it's got to be a small car or a motorbike, probably a motorbike will be easy for you. And if you've got a really small car, that works fine too. And you want to get in it guys, you want to get it as close to those drop points as you possibly can. Now the thing is here guys, uh, there's bollards in the way, so yeah, it's hard to get through in a big car. You'd have to like drive over or something. Now the boot is on the front of this one, so I'm just going to park it in between the two. Just like so. This is only actually here for like backup purposes, but that's fine. So I'm just going to park it there. Okay, so now we're going to do the duplication glitch on these junk items. So pick any one of these drop point machines and you're going to go to it. Just like so. Now to do this, guys, go to your junk items and the multiple stack is the one we're going to be doing it with that one there is just for like safety that one it actually helps us with a glitch that will hopefully appear on later on in the video so i can showcase it to you guys of how how to fix it but it shouldn't it shouldn't it shouldn't happen when you've got a spare piece of junk with you so what we're going to do guys is you can see the bottom right hand side of my screen it says sell junk that is my thumbstick so if i press and hold that while hovering above that stacked junk item just tap a as the sell button bam that will pop up now you want to sell all but one and this only works when you have more than two of same said junk it works with two but two and more it works so sell all click confirm and you'll notice you'll get another tab pop up confirm it that's doubled up so buy these both back just like so again guys hover above it click and hold that sell junk button whatever that is on your platform press and hold it i'm doing it now then tap the sell button bam that will pop up now sell all but one so keep one side of rest confirm duplicates and buy it back now what you want to do guys is you want to do this until you have 50,000 or just above 50,000 with that same piece so again I mean that sounds like a big number but it really isn't guys it really is not so because it's just it's doubling up every single time it, you'll get there in literally two minutes so again press and sell uh, press and hold the sell junk button and then tap the sell button just like so so sell all but one confirm it confirm again it doubles up buy them back confirm confirm so what i'll do guys is i'll speed up the process of the video because otherwise the video is going to go on for longer than i want it to but hey so again a couple more trot times then I'll, I'll speed it up so again guys press and hold the sell junk button then tap the sell button while hovering above that stacked junk item. Then sell all but one. Confirm. Confirm again. Doubles up. Buy these back. Again, press and hold the sell junk button while hovering above it. Then just tap the sell button. Sell all but one. Confirm. Just like so. Okay, so I'm just going to buy these back. And what I'll do now, guys, is I'll speed up the video until I get to just above 50k. Uh, because 50k is the magic number, what we want here. Um, because we actually want 100k. But if you double up, if you try and duplicate anything over 50k, drop points won't have enough money in them. And this is the max you can get. By the way, people, if you're coming to a drop point and it's lower for you, 
it's tied to your level so you need to level up to get off 320k and again this only works with junk items 99% of junk items in this game got a value of three dollars or three eddies these are the junk you want i mean if you've got jewelry if you found jewelry somewhere that's perfect if you've got more than one of the same piece it's going to be even quicker for you but again most people are only going to have junk items valued at three eddies so again i'll speed this up until they have over 50k and i'll cut back into the video and explain then Okay guys, so we now have over 50k and we want to shave these down so we have 50k, the perfect number. Because again, if I try and do this duplication with this, if you, you'll see what happens. So if I try and duplicate uh, 65,000 of a piece of junk that's worth three eddies, this is what will happen. So press and hold, click the sell, try and sell all but one, confirm it, confirm again. And it says the vendor does not have enough money. So they don't actually duplicate. So yeah, buy them back. Okay, so now we want to shave these down to exactly 50k. So go into your inventory, go to your backpack, select on your junk, it's right there, and probably dismantle. So hold to dismantle. And to work out the exact number, guys, of what you need to get to to take off to make 50k, open up a calculator, write in whatever the number is right there, and take away 50k. Whatever number your calculator says is a number you need to dismantle or drop on the floor or whatever. So for me guys, I know it's 15,537, it's quite simple maths to be honest. So yeah, I'll speed up the video because it isn't quick to get to this certain number on console because I have to hold left on my D-pad. If you're on PC, this should be quick for you. So I'll catch you guys back in a quick second. Okay, so we are there. So now guys, I'm going to dismantle the rest and now I'm left with 50,000. This is the magic number. So 50,000 of the one and still the single piece of junk there. Perfect. So now guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate it one more time. So I've got 100,000 or 999,000 of the said piece. So hover above uh, the um, item, then click and hold sell junk and tap the sell button. So all but one, confirm. Just like so. Buy these back. Just like so. Now guys, we're going to put 50k inside of our stash so 50k of the said items going in our stash so i'm just gonna half it and half well go if you press up and down if you play on console if you press up it goes to the full amount if you press down it'll cut it in half so yeah quite easy so i've got 50k on me 50k in my stash i'm just going to duplicate this again because while the one is i want 100k as backup in my stash so i'm going to duplicate this again so i'll press and hold click sell all but one bam confirm it there we go buy back so now i've got 100k on me and 50k in my stash we want it so i've got 100k in my stash again as backup so i'm just going to transfer again guys another 50k of this i think 999 is a max anyway so don't try and store more than that so there we go 50k so i've got there guys 999,000, and i've got here basically 50,000 and my one piece. Now this one piece is for, I actually kind of figured this out myself. I know I've seen a lot of complaints in the comment section of my old video about sometimes people selling items to these uh, drop points, especially junk. And when it goes to buying them back, they're like 10 times worth than what they should be. So you can't buy them back. You can't do the glitch because it costs more than what you're making. When you've got that spare piece of junk with the junk you're duplicating, it seems to like void that out so always keep that in mind but either or guys always make saves once you've got a big amount of money and you're doing a glitch make saves i'd recommend you making a save after you've duplicated this which is what i'm going to do here i want 100k on me and 100k inside of my stash as a backup so i'm just going to duplicate this again so here guys we have 100k here so i've got 100k on me and 100k inside of my my stash in my car this is where the goodness happens this is where we create that save so create a save tomorrow never knows top thing there we go okay so now guys what we're going to do is we're going to just sell half of your junk to this machine just sell half so don't do the, the glitch just sell half no duplication at all needed just sell half now guys we're going to duplicate this remaining 50k to this drop point so I'll press and hold above it bam tap the sell button confirm it so all but one there we go now we have guys 100k there 
and my other junk. All I'm going to do is I'm going to buy back this one. Leave them there. Don't worry about that. Leave them. This is your money you're making now. So again, now what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to buy these back. Buy them back. Now what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to sell them back, but duplicate and take the drop points money. So click and hold the sell junk button while hovering above them. Click sell. Sell all but one and bam. Just like so. Buy this one back. Ignore the rest. There we go. Now, guys, you can make a save. I'd recommend you doing that. But either or, skip time by 24 hours. Just like so. I will make a save as well. Just because. So now I've emptied out both drop points. But there you'll have noticed. Because you skip time, their money is back. So I'm just going to make a save. Save over that last one we just made. And now what we're going to do, guys, is take 50k out of our stash. Just like so. So split it in half. We're going to duplicate these again. Just like so. So tap uh, and hold the sell junk button while hovering above. So all but one. Bam. Just like so. We're going to buy these back. So now I have 100k on me. Put 50k back inside of your stash because you want 100k in here just for like backup purposes. So I'm just going to half it again. And once you get the rhythm down to this, guys, you're going to be doing this so fast. There we go. So I've got 100k there. 50k on me. And we're going to, guys, do it again. We're going to empty out both of these. So what we do now, guys, is we come to this drop point. We'll duplicate these firstly. So duplicate. So all but one. Bam. There we go. Now, guys. We buy them back. So I've got 100k on me again. And we have 100k in my car for backup purposes. Again here guys, you can make a save if you want to. It doesn't matter. And then guys, what we're going to do is we're going to sell 50k to this. So sell 50k. Um, just 50k. Don't do no duplication glitch here. Sell it. There it is right there. And then guys, we have another one here which we're going to duplicate. So we're just going to go to these. And we're going to duplicate these and take the drop point money again. So I'll click and hold sell junk, tap A, press up, sell all but one, bam. There we go. Don't buy these back, just buy that one back. This is all we want. Come back to this one, guys. And now we'll buy these back, just like so. Buy them all back. And now, guys, we're going to duplicate them again. Take all this drop points money. Again, because there's 50,000 here and because they're worth three eddies each. They equate to about 300,000. Again, if you're over 50k of said junk, it goes over the drop points limit in money. So you can't, you can't duplicate it. It will not work. So 50k is the magic number. So again, click and hold the sell junk button. Click sell. Sell all but one. Bam. Bam. Thank you, man. Buy this one back. And there we go, guys. I've made a million and what? A couple of minutes of me explaining it to you. But when I explain this to you guys, I'll do this way, way quicker. And from here, guys, simply skip time by 24 hours. Probably make a save again if you want to. And while from here, guys, you can just repeat the process over and over and over. Remember, having that one extra piece of junk, for me anyway, seemingly nerfs the, the bug of where junk costs way more than it should do. I've had that a couple of times now, but that normally takes that bug away. But if you're still getting a bug, like I said, create saves before you do this. Uh, between every time you make that money create saves just in case they can reload the save and try it again but it is also guys well i recommend you having 100k in your stash too of said junk item just in case the bug persists for you you've still got 100k back up and you can do it out of a drop point so yes keep that in mind but yes guys this is by far the quickest way of making that juicy money i mean about 3.7 million there in a little over a few minutes of me explaining this again if i weren't explaining it I'd make way more, so I hope this guys helped you out. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.